Hello guys and girls, uh, so this is uh, Spidey Incarnated, all that Pokemon Collector. Um, I have a few things to show you. Um, I'm actually, I've just come down with a cold again, literally just this morning. So it's going to sound a bit nasally because I am quite ill. But I've got a few things to show you anyway, so um, we'll get on with this. Um, I'll show you DVDs, I'm going to do a few videos because I've got quite a bit to show you. Um, because I have got quite, I have received quite a bit in the mail. Uh, a few things that you guys might think are pretty cool. Um, well, things I've, a few things I bought in the mail. Something I bought, <coughs> I actually went out and bought. Right, so I'll show you, I'll do this video. So, we have a few DVDs I got. Uh, this is a, it was a bundle of seven films for like £2.50. Uh, it was a really good deal. All of them work and that. Uh, all of them, no scratches on the discs and that. So, so I've got Iron Man. I've already got this. This is just the one standard one disc. I already have this, but um, I can sell this. Looks we have um, Spider Man Two, two disc special edition. I've got this as well. Um, I'll probably sell this. I know they're not very worth very much. I know Iron Man. I could probably get a few quid for. Um, Next we have Spider-Man, the first film, um, and this one's actually sealed, so that's pretty cool. I'm going to keep this one, <coughs> because that is actually sealed. Oh, that's a 2 this one, with all those. There's, there's loads of special features, uh, so that's pretty cool, so I'll be keeping that. Um, next, this is, now this is the reason why I bought it, so these are the ones I've got. So the Incredible Hulk. Uh, I haven't got that yet, and it's like a £2 film anyway, so I literally paid like an extra 50p. Um, so this is the Incredible Hulk. Um, the uh, This is the second one. They have brought out Hulk and the Incredible Hulk. These are also pretty good cases. These are the made by Amaray. Um, and then we have these. So I'll start. The Incredible Hulk. Uh, these are the series that was on Jetix. Um, so this is season one, part one. Um, so this has got quite a few episodes, six episodes on, yeah. And then we got part two. <coughs> Episode seven to thirteen. And then The Incredible Hulk and She Hulk complete season two. It's episodes fourteen to twenty one, so I'm gathering it's gonna be carrying on from that. Uh, I can only assume. So there are the DVDs, there's quite a few Quite a few DVDs for a really good price. I'm really happy about that. Um, and I also managed to get this. Uh, the Wolverine Steelbook. So this is the um, Blu-ray 3D. Um, you get the Blu-ray 3D disc, the standard Blu-ray, and you get the theatrical edition as well. Um, what's it? You get the original cinema edition, and you get the the extended cut. So you get three discs, which is really cool. You also get a sneak peek uh, of X Men: Days of Future Past, and you get um, the alternative ending to the film. So I went out to see this at the cinema actually when it first came out, um, and I really enjoyed the film. I thought it was a really good film. Uh, I was really quite a big fan of uh, Wolverine anyway, um, obviously, and <coughs> all Marvel films, all superhero films really I'm a big fan of, um, and I was on a break with a lot, with everyone, a lot of people from college, um, we just went into town as we always do on Wednesdays, and went into HMV, and we saw that, um, well I saw it anyway, um, they were looking at other stuff, I don't know what they were looking at, but I thought it was twenty two ninety nine, so it's a bit expensive, but it does come in three discs. I mean I wouldn't have paid twenty two ninety nine. Actually I probably would have paid twenty two ninety nine if it was just standard Blu ray. Because it's a HMV exclusive and there's only four thousand made. Uh so it's only a four K release, there's only four thousand made, which is really cool. Um and obviously it's H M V exclusive, so obviously with um 
with HMV going in and out of administration here and there, uh, it's really nice to see they're still doing some exclusives and that. And it's a really nice still book. I mean, it's silver, a uh, silver like silver metal color. Um, it did actually, in fact, show it was going to be white in the pre-order, and the Wolverine. It was supposed to be white, and the Wolverine letters was going to be like three D, but um, it looks nice silver anyway. It would have shown better with the the black in that if it was white, but it's still really nice. Um, I can't show you the back because I am actually in fact keeping it sealed um, because it's a four K release. I'll be keeping this sealed, and I probably will sell this in the future. Or keep it, I just want to keep it. But I can get the Wolverine on DVD or Blu ray anyway. I'll get probably get it on Blu ray in a few weeks anyway. Um, so that's it for this video. Uh, because I have another few things to show you, but that's going to be in a different video. So anyway, um, thank you for watching. And uh, oh, I also have another still book anyway to show you. Hopefully, that comes today or tomorrow. Um, I'm also getting, which I'm really excited about, this has just been the highlight of this month. Um, a Legend of Zelda, A Link Between Worlds, the Collector's Edition. Yeah, that comes out tomorrow. Um, a lot of people have got it already, the Standard Edition and the 3DS thing. But, uh, I'm getting the Collector's Edition, which means I have to go down there and get it. But, because it's exclusive to game, but it does mean that I got the Collector's Edition, so I get the little... Uh, the chest. Uh, they also get uh, like a download code for a game and a poster and the game in the box. So I'm really excited about this. Obviously, I'm uh, gonna be playing this for probably the whole weekend. Girlfriends out at a party and that. So I uh, I love the weekend. So probably fight a few mates for but I'll be playing Zelda. Um, I'll be unboxing that tomorrow. Um, as soon as I get there, and I will be showing some gameplay videos. Obviously, I don't have a capture card like most do people because I can't afford it, and they're pretty hard to track down. Um, you're looking at about if you can track one down, about three hundred fifty pound was an extortionate amount of money for me, anyway, as a student. But anyway, thank you for watching. Um, look forward to the Amazing Spider-Man still book I'm getting, and the Zelda. So thank you for watching, please comment, like and subscribe and see you later.